What's up guys? Today we are watching John Wick 3. So, the second movie, in my opinion, was better than the first movie because it started off with action and I just like that kind of opening. But also because a dog didn't die in it. Don't kill a damn dog. That's like one of the worst things to do in a movie. And that's what they did. But the second movie, the dog was fine. Still don't know its name. So hopefully in this movie it actually tells us what the dog's name is. But yeah, the last movie also ended off with now like everyone after John Wick. All the assassins, whatever the hell they are, they're going after him. And I don't know how he's going to survive, but obviously he does because there's a fourth movie coming out soon. So I guess let's get into the movie. Communicado. In effect, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Oh yeah, he's at the top, top. Oh, I thought, I thought John Wick was pulling up back there. Like, you're really going back to that hotel after everyone's after you now. Tick-tock, Mr. Wick. Tick-tock. Even he's one. <laughs> the Continental. Can you see that he's received by the concierge? Yes, sir, Mr. Wick. Good dog. I'm gonna miss you, dog. Probably not gonna see you to the end of the movie. So you really trusted the fact that no one else would take that book? What if someone did? Then they would have had your shit. Dante. Looking a little run down there, John. Ernest. You're a tall man. He's almost up. He's beating you with the book. How much does it take that man to go down? Okay. I thought his teeth would have been down his throat, to be honest. Like... But it took a lot just to take him down. He got hit so many times. Didn't you get- yeah, he got stabbed in the shoulder. Excommunicado. In effect, ten minutes. Why do people seem to be going after him now? Even though the thing's not in effect until ten. Did I say ten? I think I- I meant like ten minutes, not at uh, ten. Excommunicado. In effect, one minute. At this point, it kind of it's kind of like why get that wound fixed because you're just gonna like reopen it sooner or later because that's what happens like in the past two movies. One guy was already after him, and then the other guy who followed him. They started too early. Where? Here, just below my floating rib. Be sure not to hit my. Oh wait. Okay. One may not be enough. You want another one? Yeah. All right. Be sure not to graze my. There's a lot of confidence in that man's aim, like. 
What if he I missed and like hit you in the heart? Gotta speed up your process. <laughs> Man got stabbed in the back twice. Knives, bruh. How is that dude still alive for a good few seconds? Like he got stabbed in the head. They all went after him and still ended up dead. Who thinks that they're gonna be able to defeat this man? <laughs> How many cars does that make that he got hit by? because he, he got hit by a few in the last two movies. Is he gonna get away on a horse? Get away on a horse. He's beating your ass on a horse, bruh. I'm sorry, I need to see like behind the scenes kind of shit for this. Cause it's like, how? <laughs> Yurimi. What's so special about his belt? Sirta is my boblimini. The dos nomini pamuch. You are bound. And I am old. He's an orphan? All of this for what? Is a sabachki? At the Bolani Prost of The... Yeah, it wasn't just a puppy. Like, it's a whole different story, even though it kind of seems like it started because of something little. So tell me, Jardine. What do you really want? Percy. Where did you want to go? He's about to be branded. Was it not? Oh, yes. As a matter of fact, the body gets colder within these very walls. I'd like to see it. Why? I understand that you have your loyalties, but this cannot be overlooked. Let me be clear, I am here to adjudge you. You have one week to get your affairs in order. So she's gonna try and take him down since he let him go. In the meantime, if you need any assistance with your transition, you may look for me in room 217. 
Enjoy your stay at the Continental. Threatens to take his job, staying at his hotel. No IP addresses. No digital footprint. Can't track it. Can't hack it. Can't trace it. Can you get disease? True. Well, I wouldn't recommend that you eat. <laughs> what the hell do you want? For what exactly? To settle your affairs and find a new home for your birds. In seven days, you abdicate your throne. God damn, so she's going after everyone who, like, somewhat helped John Wick. Do not make the mistake of thinking you exist outside the rules no men do. You have seven days. Well, shit. I'm afraid our friend here is off limits. But he's excommunicado. It seems the manager has granted him amnesty. Really? Would you be so kind as to come with me? No hesitation. You a dog person, John? Sophia? Wait, is that Halle Berry? This is your blood. Your bond. When you needed help, I was there. Do you want to know where she is? No. I don't ever want to know. Because I don't trust that I won't go find her. Pardon me. Damn. There is a task. It involves someone who broke the rules and stood against the table. John Wick, you mean? My students have not been idle. John Wick and all who helped him. Are they going to kill her because she helped John Wick? And you helped John Wick. He had a ticket. But a ticket does not stand above the table. Your penance will be paid in blood. Now. So they are gonna kill her? Hold out your... I will be of service. Ew. I thought they were gonna like do something more. Oh, like that was brutal, but like. But she's not dead, not so dead. that's a plus. I seek to make amends. To pay for what I've done, I seek a meeting with the one who sits above the table. How are you gonna make amends? How does that work? I don't think they just forgive you for all the shit that you've done. You have received a great gift. I have hosted your friend. What do you offer in return? He he gonna want one of your dogs. Yes, so Very well. Very well. Now they're all gonna try and fight. Of course, this killing another dog. Oh, wait. You see what happened, though? John started killing because of his dog, and now she started killing because he almost tried to kill her dog. my dog I get it exactly see y'all could be good partners so does that mean y'all are gonna stick together for the rest of the movie or <laughs> see 
see her dogs are like sweet but also vicious and his dog is sweet but pit bulls are made to seem like everyone always thinks that they're also vicious when like they can be but that's not always the case but it's like i like how his dog is a sweet one but hers are like sweet and vicious maybe if they train john's dog it could be the same that's amazing They're such a badass team. Whether out here on this desert or somewhere else down the road. But you are gonna die. But that doesn't mean it has to be right now. Sophia. So that's just the end of them. Man, I thought it'd be cool if they stuck together for the rest of the movie. Man's out in the desert in a suit with barely any water. So they're going to try and kill him now? Has it already been seven days? Well, since you see it that way, I guess it's time I told you to climb down off your high table and go fuck yourself. Duly noted. <laughs> you gave John Wick seven bullets. Your penance will be paid with. Long live the king. I can't believe he's really dead. So does that mean they're gonna go after the other dude too? Like the one who like let him go? I keep forgetting his name. I thought it started with a W. But like, I swear if they kill him too, like. What? He has forgotten he's filthy. Neither the open contract nor the excommunicado will be lifted until you complete your task. He has to kill Winston. If you wish to remember, cast aside your weakness and reaffirm your fealty to the table. I have a feeling he's not actually going to do it because him and Winston were friends. Like, he's not the type of person to turn. But it's like, like maybe that's what the fourth movie is about. He doesn't kill Winston, so like, he's still, you know. He ain't killing Winston. I have a feeling he's not. <laughs> you with you? It was. Still going on the bridge, even though it's closed. Throw yourself off the bike. So, 
put your weapon down. <laughs> He's excommunicado. Unless you... Please take a seat. I will let him know you have arrived. Where's his dog? His dog's there. You could have sat all the way on the other side. May you chose to sit next to him. And so far, you haven't disappointed. <laughs> he likes you. Me? In the administrative lounge, sir. Oh, wait, so he's actually there, so now... So now he's gonna have to either kill Winston or just let him in on the plan. Have to see what your opponent is holding under the table. <laughs> How is your journey here, eventful? Yeah. Okay. Does he know he had to come here to kill him? Just don't make the mistake of pretending this is personal. If you feel you must, put a bullet through my heart. No. I don't think I am. So it's war. You're going to war with the high table. Skirmish. Unless you decide to shoot me, but then I'd rather die. That bitch again. He gonna shoot her. I think not. And you? Will you be putting a bullet in his head? I think not. No. Um. I don't think I will. Very well. Pew. Oh. I thought they were getting ready to just shoot her in the back of the head. Administration. New York Continental Hotel has been deconsecrated. Is that the dude who played Oswald in Gotham? He kind of reminds me of him, but I don't know if that's actually him. Gentlemen, this institution is now deconsecrated. Limits to me. Under the circumstances, your <laughs> privileges are reinstated immediately. What do you need? <laughs> guns. Lots of guns. We'll be sending some of our finest for additional support. Cool. Like that's gonna help yeah. them. <laughs> Shiro, would you help set the mood for our new guests? Of course, sir. Are they gonna die? Listening to classical music. Why isn't he going out there and shooting with him? How many bullets does it take for you to die, man? Don't tell me he's gonna die. Okay. Need more firepower. <laughs> They're just sitting there enjoying their time. Armor improvements. Twelve gauge steel slugs. Armor PC. Maybe I should have had that in the first place.
am. I'm really hoping this man don't die. Like, I feel like that's what's gonna happen, but I'm like, I'm really hoping not. That place kind of looks like the place from the second movie when, or it was it the first movie when he went go try and kill that dude. And he was in the club, or whatever. Only by my sword, John. Of course, you're one of those characters. I know you believe you can keep this up, but I assure you. <laughs> That place is just so aesthetic. How is the glass like barely impenetrable or whatever whenever you like shoot at it or something? But as soon as like he gets thrown at it, bam, it's like breaks so easily. Like I thought a bullet would be able to go through it more than a well I don't know more than human body um so now but the one Mr. Wick Bunga but I don't demand Mr. Wick to fight with you okay oh um, Oh, so that wasn't true. Lambat dia sekarang. Harusnya dia sudah pensiun lima tahun lalu. Tapi tetap saja. Jangan lupa. He's still in like the best shape of his life. You see how long this man can go for? He needs one of those belts that can turn into a fucking sword. That'd be cool. <laughs> he just clapped your ears. still beat all of my students. If I didn't have to kill you, we'd be pals. No one said you had to. I didn't last that long. Hey, John. That was a pretty good fight, huh? How are you not dead yet, man? Yeah. Like, just trying to make casual conversation as you're stabbed? 
Me, John. Just gotta catch my breath. I'll catch up to you, John. <laughs> Run way beyond this building. We are high table. And we are New York City. <laughs> are we negotiating? And been a beacon of order and stability to our industry for over 40 years. Now I humbly acknowledge I overstepped and repledged my fealty to the high table. What about John? Are you just gonna... He just killed all them people for you. But what about him? What are we going to do about John Wick? Exactly. Oh, he has to die. Sorry, Jonathan. What a hoe. You're straight up a bitch, Winston. Well played, sir. They're trash, bruh. Mr. Wick is gone. A true tragedy. You misunderstand. I mean that he is no longer on the street. Hmm. Seems improbable. And yet, true. How far can he get? Did they help him maybe try and fake his death or something? I don't know. He's still alive! Oh shit, they took a finger. Ain't that a bitch? <laughs> oh, John fucking Wick. How do you feel? Cause I am really pissed off. You pissed John. Are you? I don't fucking blame him for being pissed. Like, literally, Winston's a bitch. He literally did that. But, dude, okay. Third movie is definitely way better than second and first one. They, can, they just keep getting better and better. And that's rare because sometimes sequels to movies and shit could be pretty trash. But, in this case, it is not... And still, he did not even name his dog. What the hell? If he doesn't say something in the fucking fourth movie, then... It's like, come on. But I really can't believe Winston did that to him. This man just can't catch a break. Like, literally, the movie started off all the way in the front. Like, since, like, the end of the movie, of, like, the second movie... It's like he hasn't caught a break. He's been like going and going and going and barely got any rest. And he was still able to take them bitches out. It's crazy. But it's like, I'm ready to see them two cut up, beat some ass. Because that was straight bullshit. And Halle Berry better come back for the second, well, well for the fourth one too. I don't even know if there's... Is there a trailer for the fourth movie? Because I know it's not out yet, but still. That still just like made me feel so bad. <laughs> but I'm ready for the fourth one to come out, so I'll be reacting to the fourth one when it comes out, so 